my stars, it's me Missy, I'm back, and today I'm going to be playing some Mass Effect Andromeda due to popular demand. I've never played this game before. I've never played this game before. I've played Mass Effect the first three games. I've never played this. I have no idea what it's about. But with that, let's get into the game. Well, I guess I should just customize the character, right? And hopefully everything works and we have no scuff. Initializing, okay. I am female. Appearance. Um, let's customize the appearance. Second. One second, guys. I gotta fix a thing. Because apparently things don't like to work. There we are. Now it's fixed. Okay, I think we're good now. Oh my god, what is all this? Okay, we're gonna... Let's do this one, I guess. this. Brows. Brow height is fine. Assuming the brow depth is fine. I'm just gonna leave these alone, Chen. That's fine, I guess. Eyes, depth, width, mouth, width thickness. I'm not good at customizing characters, so bear with me while I try. That looks better. I think the nose looks fine to me. Hairstyle, okay. Start all the way at the end. I don't like that. That's a maybe. Eh. No. Maybe. No. That looks kind of cute. That's okay. No, I don't want anything with their hair back. No. 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 I think the second one? Third one? The third one I liked, okay. Oh, I can do pa pastel colors? Pastel colors. What are you? You're like a light lavender. 
Ooh. That's not the exact purple, but it's pretty damn close. It's like an electric purple, kind of. Electric bluish purple. Mmm. Let's do that. I can customize the inner and outer color of my eyes. What the hell? Outer color. Okay, we're going to make the outer color pink. We're going to make the inner color purple. Make a nice, deep purple. Okay, there we go. What's this? Makeup, okay. Oh, there's eyeliner. Um... No, no. Actually, that might be a yes. No, no, no. No, no. Kind of like... Kind of like that one. Eyeliner color. I'm fine with black, I think. Maybe I should do like... Very light pink. She's probably going to look awful by the end of all this, but I'm fine with that. Eyeshadow. The pick as possible. No. 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 That actually seems okay. No. I actually kind of like that. Why do I like that? No. No. Mmm. Maybe. This might be better, though. My shadow color. What color should I do for this? Blue. Hmm. I'm hoping to spend a lot of time on this, so maybe we'll just do a dark color or no eyeshadow. for now. I don't know why I don't mind that, but I don't, surprisingly. Lipstick style, lip gloss, the lipstick opacity. No. No, no, no. Maybe, no, no. That looks kind of cool. No. Normal. Okay. Hi! Jay Bear was taken. Oh, that's cute! like this. Kind of. Kind of like it. Mm. 
Black? Black. Yes, black. I don't like blush. Blush kind of blush kind of sucks, but well, I want to see what blush looks like in, in the game. Blush looks actually kind of cool. I'm surprised. Color is fine. Eyeshadow color. Let's just look at the eyeshadows again. I want to see what she would look like without it. She looks kind of nice. Mm. So far, that's my favorite. Actually, looks. Okay-ish. Mm. I like this look for some reason. I really like this look for some reason. That's really cool. <laughs> What's this? Oh, you can do scars and tattoos. Holy shit! I gotta, I, I gotta see the scars. I gotta see the scars. Hold on. No? I think my hair's covering that? Hmm. That looks kind of cool. I like that. I like that more. Might like that most. No. 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 Maybe. No. No. Maybe. No. No. Yes? No. 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 Okay. I kinda like that. I like that. It's not- it's not too intrusive, but it's- it's there and you can tell it's there. No more intensity there. Okay, that's good. Now, what tattoos do they have? Hmm. Hmm. No. My hair is probably covering it. My hair is probably covering that as well. That's kind of cool. I don't like that. I don't like that. Maybe. Ooh, I like the neck thing. That's cool. Well, I can be just a whole ass skeleton. Kiss can scare the fuck out of the enemy. Uh, no. <laughs> Sadly, no. Maybe another time. Hmm. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, do I want to put anything else on her face? I guess, I guess I shouldn't. I guess I shouldn't. I guess I should be good and not do that thing, but at the same time, tattoos are cool and scars are cool. I'll leave her alone. She looks, she has a nice face. Okay. I like her face. I think we're going to go with this face. I might change the hair color though. I don't know. Lighter. That's too light. Mmm, it matches the eyeliner. That's too blue, I think. That's. We'll do this. We'll do this color. Yeah, she does, doesn't she? Okay. Think sh I think that. Oh gosh, that's fine. Mm, gender, I did appearance, I believe. Yeah. Customized training. 
Security during your alliance. Military service. You focused on learning everything you could about weapons and tactics. Concussive shot. Turbo. Turbo. Singularity barrier. Technician. Overload. Invasion. Hex support. I vaguely remember these things. Energy drain. Annihilation. Leave a shifting aura of mass effect fields around you to slowly damage nearby foes. Develop specialized technology to bolster the survivability of your entire squad. Okay, that's good. Combat fitness charge. Just stay with security, I guess. Who's the name? Missy. I can customize my twin. You know what? He can be the normal twin. I'll be the weird one. You heard Alec Ryder's appearance. Choose the appearance of your father. Alec Ryder, his appearance can either adapt to your player's customization or remain as the default version. This option on Alec Ryder's appearance will be based on your customized Ryder. Setting this off, we use it. Here, customize appearance. Okay, and well, that's you know what? That's fine with me. Customize history. Choose the gen. Choose the gender of the legendary Commander Shepard, first human specter and hero of the Citadel. Mine was female. Did we get that? Good. Female. Badass bitch. Okay. Upload character data. Didn't know this was a thing. If I had known, I would have... Okay, cool. I'll have to remember that next time. <laughs> it's cool. I guess, I guess, um, I guess we're ready. Confirm and start. We're gonna do normal and hope I don't lose my head. Sure, let's start the game. I'm very worried. It's been a long time since I've played Mass Effect games. Uh oh. <laughs> Every great moment in our history began that with That scared me. Each bold leap forward was achieved by those willing to do anything to attain it. We are, all of us, leaving behind families, homes, the very birthplace of our species. Some for discovery to see the unknown, others for a new start. But today, whatever our reasons, we take the first steps toward a new future for humanity. Today, we begin to make our dream reality. In the year 2185, humanity lives in a golden era of interstellar travel. Our discovery of ancient alien ruins on Mars propelled our understanding of science and technology ahead by thousands of years. While many now enjoy the newfound freedom and challenges of exploration in the Milky Way, others look to even more distant stars. The 100,000 adventurers embarking on this one-way voyage, the future begins in...
Andromeda. I can agree so far it is the best looking Mass Effect. <laughs> 634 years later, oh my god. Well, that's awesome. I remember enjoying being Commander Shepard. I had so much fun doing that. Arc Hyperion, occupancy 20,000 human colonists. Andromeda Galaxy Destination Habit Habitat 7 in Helios Cluster. It'd be cool if Mass Effect Relays were por uh, portable. Cannot speak. Don't know why. I look horrible, but it's fine. That was a beautiful opening. We made it. Deep breaths. You're gonna wanna take it easy. I've been taking it easy for 600 years. Ryder, recon specialist, Pathfinder mission team. Pathfinder team, eh? The ones finding us a home. Can you make it somewhere tropical? Nice, warm ocean, summer year-round? <laughs> How about we get her a cup of coffee? Yeah, first? I do. It's pretty. It's fake, isn't it? Yeah, it was fake. I'm so disappointed. Ryder, let's get you checked out. Look here. After discovering an unusually high ratio of potential candidates for Golden Worlds, the Helios Cluster was selected as our destination. Yeah, we are Twitch purple, aren't we? The first wave of arcs arriving in Andromeda, our new home for humanity. Makes it sound so easy, doesn't it? I have tone choices. It makes it sound so easy, doesn't it? Easy, easy's no fun, or it's what we're trained for. Okay, so professional or casual? Easy's no fun. I'll go with that. I hope not. I signed up for a little adventure before we settle down. Well, buckle up. Sounds like you'll get your wish. Yeah? Over here now, the Pathfinder wants you all on your feet right away. He said mission ready within the hour. Any idea why? Okay. No, but I'm guessing that's where your adventure comes in? Okay, everything checks out. Just one more thing before I send you on your way. Let's test your Sam. Who are you, dude? Sam, are you monitoring? Sam, are you online? Yes, Dr. Taparo. Good morning. Awesome. Mark. Are you feeling well? Still thawing. I feel like a 600-year-old popsicle. I hope we pack more coffee. Readings confirmed. Oh Based god, not coffee. In your system, the neural implant is functioning properly. Wait, I don't know what? It just means you're still shaking off your nap. No reason why we can't get you on your way. Okay. Though you may want to hang around while we revive your brother. It always helps to see a familiar face. I don't like the sound of that. No, that did not s Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Well, that's bad. That does not look good. At all. Oh, that's worse. Um, guys. Okay, we're alive. What's happening? Well, we're starting off strong. Oh, gosh. Oh, to look. 
careful of the syringe. I'm almost inside. Hold on. An anomaly, huh? Okay. This is Cora. I'm at the cryo bay. Brace for a reset. Oh goody, I get smashed into the floor. Everyone okay? I think so. What happened? We're not sure. Sensors are scrambled. But it's good to see you're up. Feels like centuries since we spoke. This is the Pathfinder. Mission teams continue preparations. Cora, riders, report to the bridge. You heard him. Let's get- Uh, we have a problem over here. It's Scott Ryder. Don't tell me he's stuck in there forever. What's wrong? I don't know. Have to check it out. Oh, I can run. Okay. Well, hey, Doc. It looks like some sort of power surge. What's up? Stays... Ryder, is my brother okay? Scott's fine. His vitals are strong, but the revival procedure was interrupted. What's the prognosis? When can he wake up? We don't want to rush it. Sam? My connection to Scott's implant was suspended. However, his pulse, respiration, and brain activity are all normal. To be on the safe side, we'll need to keep him in a low-level coma for a while. Then let his body regain consciousness naturally. Okay. He'll be fine. Glad to hear it. Thanks, Lexi. You keep us updated. Right. I'll wait for you at the door the whenever camp. you're ready to go. I need damage assessment updates. How do you want to handle this? I can talk to you more. Don't worry, Ryder. We'll take care of him. He'll make it. Okay. I can inspect things. Ooh. Still in stasis. Vitals look good. Hi there. I'm Jean Garson, founder of the Andromeda Initiative. I'm here to welcome you to a whole new galaxy. The okay. The hard part's over. We're here. If you have any questions now, just ask. I'll ask everything. Pathfinders. Pathfinder is responsible for exploring and assessing new worlds for outpost placement and settlement. Each arc is led by a Pathfinder who represents their species. The active duty Pathfinder assigned to Arc Hyperion is Alec Ryder. Current duty roster shows you are assigned to the Pathfinder mission team, Specialist Ryder. Okay, cool. Go ahead, tell me the backstory. Andromeda Initiative. The Andromeda Initiative encompasses all colonization efforts, including arcs, pathfinders, outposts, and the central support hub, the Nexus. The current location of the Nexus is unknown. Status of outposts are unknown. Message from the founder. I'm Gian Garson. Founder of the okay, initiative. Well, we heard this I already. think it's important we take a moment to skip get started skip life it. in Andromeda can be anything we dare to dream. And I'm proud to help make those dreams come true. Drop me a note sometime. I'd love to hear how we're doing. Okay, that's kind of cool. Mission status. At present, Arc Hyperion has arrived in the Helios Cluster. Further mission updates are offline due to technical difficulties. As Recon Specialist, you are tasked with supporting the authentication of Golden World sites through exploration, mapping, and scientific analysis. Currently, you are to report for duty on the command bridge. Our destination? The selection process saw the Andromeda Initiative evaluate thousands of potential habitable planets within the galaxy. After discovering an unusually high ratio of potential candidates for Golden Worlds, the Helios Cluster was selected as our destination. Now you are a part of the first wave of ARCs arriving in Andromeda, our new home for humanity. Once the Pathfinder team's assessment is complete, Habitat 7 has been selected as the most likely candidate for colonization. Okay, cool. The other arcs? Your current location is Arc Hyperion, housing the human population. Arc Parchero, the Solarian vessel, confirmed departure in 2185. The Asari ship, Arc Lucinia, confirmed departure that same year, as did the Turian Arc Natanis, embarking in 2185. Okay, thanks. Log off. 
I can talk to you? Hayes. It sounds amazing, doesn't it? Right up until you lose gravity. Okay. I'm gonna be an ass and wander around, guys. This one's still asleep. Sweet dreams. Sweet dreams! Anything else? No? No? Okay. Hey, look at my goofy ass run. Oop, data pad. Oop. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Ooh, I can. That's cool. Attention Hyperion personnel, after a 600 year voyage, the good news is we're exactly where we're supposed to be. We have arrived in the Helios Cluster, Andromeda Galaxy here. 28019. All stasis medical personnel should report for duty immediately. Give Pathfinder mission team revival priority and prep its members for fields reconnaissance. Report of an unusual celestial phenomenon in the cluster are being investigated. Updates to follow. Captain Dunn. Okay. Okay, cool. Who are you? Hey Costa? Hell of a wake up call. Liam. Didn't expect that first thing out of stasis. Makes two of us. Hang in there. Enjoy your nap, Ryder. Don't think I'll need sleep for the rest of my life. <laughs> Maybe another decade or two wouldn't have hurt. <laughs> <laughs> right. Talk to you later. Broken. Bye, buddy. Another data pad message from Garrison, hello traveler and welcome to your first day in Andromeda. This is the dawn of a new era for all of us. As for your recover, as you recover from stasis, know that you're in good hands. In a few short hours, you'll be leaving the Hyperion and joining thousands of your fellow colonists as you chase your fortunes and build the new life you've always dreamed about. It's been a long wait, but I promise you, it will be worth it. Awesome. Fisher. Morning, Ryder. Or afternoon. Or I don't know. Yeah, who cares? I don't think time has much relevance right now. Kirkland? Hello. Good to see you, Ryder. Hmm. <sighs> oh, sorry, still waiting for some coffee. Mm, you're good, my man. Okay, I guess that's it. Okay, we're gonna go in. Open the door. Oh, fuck. Well, that's not good. Okay. So. Um. Ryder could find it. She has a scanner. Quick, Ryder, use it to locate the fault. On it. I'll try to get readings on the second conduit. Gee. Hey, well, get on this one. I'll override the safeties. Got it. There's no indication of a fault in this component. Keep looking. Relay 2C shows damage from a temperature spike. Okay. Found it. Bad relay. Ryder, can you go reset it? How do I reset it? Okay. Well. It's reset. Okay, that's good. I'm gonna back away, just in case. What the fuck? Really? I can scan things now. Well, pardon me while I go fuck around. Can I talk to you? No? Okay. I'll stop fucking around for now. Oh, data pad! Automated logs, departure, stasis, anomalous, trajectory, trajectory course correction. Uh, error! Okay. Thank you for that. The adventure begins. 
I thought it already or began when we woke up. I thought it would... Go ahead and take us to the bridge. Wait a second. Let me look. Let me look at everything. God, this is so cool. It has been so long since I've played Mass Effect. Helm control, report. We're drifting. Flight controls aren't responding. First priority is stopping these outages. Mainline power's been knocked out. We're on That's not Captain. good looking. They won't last. What's our position? Unknown. We lost telemetry. Sam, we need eyes out there. Attempting to adjust sensor array. Alec, please. You may be Pathfinder, but this is my ship. Captain, the protocol's clear. In the absence of communication with the Nexus or the other arcs, we proceed to our appointed golden world. Solid ground. If it's even out there. Nobody said anything about running into an energy cloud. And that's just a wild guess what we hit. Okay. Well, this doesn't seem good. For us. Alec, I need to assess the damage. Stop Dude, your bleeding. forehead is We've got 20, massive. We've 20,000 people asleep on this ship. Let's give them a chance to wake up. Can you blame her? Honestly, I prefer solid ground. My father's got a point, though. Solid ground sounding pretty good right now. Yeah, but... Pretty good isn't good enough. Yes, sir. Okay, Dick. We're coming through. I'm sensing some tension. My god. Is that our golden world? Well, it looks That's like the Golden World's seven. dead. New Earth, if we're lucky. That doesn't look good at all. All of our long-range scans told us it was in the Green Zone. Perfect for human settlement. It doesn't even look the same. It looks bad. She's right. It looks pretty dicey from here. Are we sure about those scans? It's a good question. Things can change. It's been 600 years. Sam. Yeah, exactly. The energy from the phenomenon is dumping our senses. Planetary conditions are unknown. Oh, great. He has our eyes. 20,000 souls adrift at sea. And when the power runs out and stays out, we need to know if that's safe harbor. Exactly. And if it's not. Well, we're fine. As Pathfinder, it'll be my job to find an alternative. It's what we trained for. But if this goes well, we are already home. Well, we can only hope, right? All right, just make it quick. Harper, the rest of the team should be awake by now. Have them spin up two shuttles. Planet Fallen 30. Yes, sir. A stubborn one, isn't he? He is not a people person. No one ever said Dad was a diplomat. People skills were never his strong suit. Just as long as he knows what he's doing. It's not like the cavalry's coming to save the day. Yeah, we we know that. I need an ETA on our sensor repairs. We're blind out here. Oh, great. Goody, goody, goody. Brother's going to hate that he missed this. Are all the riders adrenaline junkies? Probably. I guess it's in our blood. I was born a minute ahead of him. I never let him forget it. <laughs> Don't worry. I'm sure Scott will pull through. Yeah, and when he does, he'll want to hear stories. So, let's get out there and find him one. Exactly. Right. We'll have some fun. You don't want to get your helmet. And maybe stop at the good luck rock before we go. There's a good a luck what? rock. It's an old super. One sec. Introduction as a member of the Pathfinder team, you play a critical role in Andromeda's initi Andromeda initi initiative's efforts to establish a foothold in the new galaxy. The team facing team faces many challenges: Golden World site verification, reconnaissance, and mapping of unknown territories, planetary and celestial, scientific analysis and discovery of new phenomenon, potential first contact with extra ex extraterrestrials, reestablishing diplomatic relations in local. 
With local inhabitants, general support of settlement outposts. Okay. Nice to know, nice to know. They have a water cooler. Right. So awesome. Hey, Fisher. How's it going? I heard a rumor from the bridge that your dad and the captain aren't seeing eye to eye on this. It's true. She wasn't thrilled with the idea of the expedition. My dad won her over. Glad Dunn came around. Your dad's the N7 here. He's got the most experience. And the best aim. I go wherever he goes. Okay, cool. Good to know, my man. Dad's we rock. Good luck, Rock, huh? I'll take Dad some good luck. Climbing back on Earth. It caught him from falling. The way things are going today, we'll need any luck we can get. I agree. Cora. <laughs> so just another boring day at the office, huh? The Pathfinder team is assembling in the hangar. We can handle it. I figure it's a chance to show everyone what we can do. Go out there and earn our stripes. You're Alex's daughter, all right. I always wondered what it was like when explorers crossed the ocean. Nothing but stars and dead reckoning to guide them. Well, you're finding out now. Said, Here be dragons. Well, if they made it, we can too. And maybe see a dragon along the way. Let's not get eaten. I'd prefer to eat lunch, not be lunch. <laughs> you're not a real explorer till you've got some scars or bite marks. On that note, I'd better get my gear in order. Um, if we're gonna do bite marks, I'd rather not be the food. Deactivate. Crashing the party, huh? Yep. Uh, sorry. Hey, Ryder. It's Kirkland, right? Yeah. I think we met just before the Hyperion left Earth. Not sure if you know Greer. <laughs> Hi there. That's cool. You dad say anything about what's going on? Mmm. Sensors are scrambled. Tough to say. Sensors can't get a read on the planet. Well, at least it keeps things interesting. Yeah. You're ashamed to go through all this training and not put it to good use. I agree. See you guys on the ride down. This is the captain. I'll give you back your music. Helmet. Is there anything else here before I. Oh, there! First contact protocol. In the event any member of the Pathfinder team encounters intelligent alien life, it is imperative that first contact pro protocols be strictly observed. The Andromeda Initiative holds the principles of peace and cooperation among other, not other, among our highest ideals. Aggressive action against extraterrestrials in, is only permitted when hostile intent is clearly demonstrated in Pathfinder. Team members are at obvious risk of injury or death. Okay, nice to know. I'll try and play nice. I can't promise anything, though, because I was a bitch in my last life. I can inspect these. Looks like Dad's already suited up. Hang in there, Scott. Well, Brother Boo will be back for you eventually. Got I got my helmet. Look at me. I did a good. Is now requiring sidearms. I've opened the armaments locker. Are we expecting trouble, Sam? Probably. Please arm yourself, Ryder. Plan to. Thank you. Better safe than sorry. Exactly. Now let's get to the shuttle. Okay, let's get. Dr. Carlyle, with everything going on, I think the Ark needs you more than we do. Pathfinder wants a medic on hand, and if that is home down there, I'm happy to knock on the door. It's gonna get rough. Yeah, we're just not sure what's on the other side of the door. No problem. If it has teeth, I brought the pliers. Yank them out myself. Well, aren't you just a badass? Nice right, to meet you, ma'am. We leave in five. Sir, we broke out the weapons as requested. Anything we should know about? Seem prudent, given the situation. We'll be down a man with Scott out. Hmm. I heard what happened. Your brother's strong. He'll make it. You better. 
He better. 600 year nap and he oversleeps. You know him. Never was an early riser. <laughs> Aren't Just you don't too let cute? It get to you. I need you sharp. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Your mom would have been proud of both of you. Gee, thanks, Dad. Okay, team, listen up. I chose each of you for the Pathfinder team, not just because you're talented and passionate, but because you're dreamers, like me. We dream of exploring the unknown, of finding the edge of the map, and then discovering what lies beyond. When people look back on this, and they will, they'll remember we didn't give up, that we kept dreaming that our first few faltering steps in Andromeda were the beginning of everything they know. We only get one chance to be first. So, let's go make history. Okay, yes, let's. This ought to be fun. Been waiting 600 years for this. Well, the music is awesome. Archive period, this is Shuttle 1. Switching to manual guidance. Shuttle 2, taking your lead. Good luck, Pathfinder team. Turning to Vector 135. Copy that. We're on point. Okay. Oh, gosh, that's cool and terrifying. Stop the Hyperion in its tracks. It appears to be an unstable mass of dark energy. Okay. Say so. Stay clear of it. Yeah, let's not touch that. Gravity anomalies detected. Oh well, shit. We're <laughs> clear. This is cool. Ryder, we didn't have a chance to meet back in the Milky Way. Name's Liam Costa, security and response specialist. Well, hello, Liam. Good to meet you, Liam. Hard to believe we're finally doing this. Sure beats reading the brochures. Oh, my bad. God, this is cool. Here we go. The flight guidance is scrambled. It'll pass. The controls are fighting. Oh, that does not look good. Copy that. Doesn't look like a golden world from here. No, not really. Oxygen levels are below minimum human requirements. Oh, that's great. Oh, there's lightning. We have this all worked out. Keep it tight, shuttle two. Uh the mountains are floating. Look, port side. That has to be advanced engineering. Iberia, this is the Pathfinder. We've got What the fuck is that? Has anyone seen us? What if they're not friendly? We stick to contact protocol. No use of deadly force unless hostile intent is clear. Oh, fuck. I don't like that. Mm. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm falling. Acceleration increasing. No kidding! Your um, jet is malfunctioning. Yeah, oh, great. Working. Approaching terminal velocity. Sam! That's not good. <laughs> oh, God, that's gotta hurt. Ooh! Oh, that's worse. You can heal your you can you can fix your freaking helmets? That's that's a that is a smart invention. Oh my god, that's a smart invention. So smart. Well this looks creepy. 
You see the lightning and the floating rocks really give it that feel. This is Ryder, come in. I bet no one can hear us. Uh, Hyperion! Sam! Anyone there? Save your breath, Liam? Hi, Liam. Sam's I'm surprised we are too. Any survivors? Did the others make it? I don't know. It was all a blur. Shuttle split in two. This is like some nightmare. Yeah, but we're awake. Yeah. No way this is home. Looks like we're gonna find some high ground. See if anyone else is alive. Come on. Ryder. Achievement unlocked. Final contact. I'm not final contact. Contact. First contact. What the fuck, brain? I'm having well, issues today. If you couldn't us. tell. Those rocks out there are floating. Well, no shit, Very Sherlock. Funny. I noticed that already. Communication relay. No fixing this. Must have broken on impact. Probably. Oh. Nice fun guy. Don't breathe the air. Found that out the hard way. Got it. You think that energy cloud we saw could cause all this? Probably. Sam said it's dark energy, but that's in space. Yeah, hell of a cloud. A cloud that makes boulders float. I have a theory. What if this? Uh, what the hell is this? Ooh. Come on, we gotta get through it. What if this planet this is, is already being colonized by another Captain race? Oh dear lord. Damn it. Sprint, baby, sprint. Shit, that hard. Oh, I bet it did. Look safer under there. Is this for real? What the hell's going on with this place? Yeah, it seems for real. Okay, that's cool. I can How's your gun? I can do that. Run. That's awesome. Take a shot at that fuel cell. It's busted anyway. What fuel cell? Look. Something flying around in the sky. Oh, wow. I'd okay, say it's that's how I shoot. What the fuck are those? Okay, that's cool. God damn. Locate other members of the Pathfinder. There. Get up that cliff. We find high ground. I, I can't on. have this? Okay, Not fine. Sure we no, probably not. I think I can see a path up. We'll use the jump jets if we have to. Into the breach! Think what the is? Give it a minute. More glowing mushrooms. Are they making that noise? No. Coming from inside the mountain. Interesting. Okay. Wonder what that is. Okay, let's keep going. I like this. How'd my dad find you? I was a cop. Then crisis response. Yeah? Tell you over a beer sometime. Ooh, I did it. Ooh, fuck. That's it. We're getting there. Voila. I think I see the top. It's ain't too bad so far. My guess, not good news. Trouble? Mystery yourself. I'd say trouble. It's not a hotel, that's for sure. Nothing around here makes any sense. New galaxy, new ways to die. Just not today. Mm-hmm. Ryder, it's Fisher. Wait, look. Oh, that's not a good thing either. That's great. Okay, hi, buddy. Who are you and what are you? And are you a bad guy? Probably. Looks like it. Hmm. Holy shit. What was first contact protocol again? 
No deadly force unless fired upon. <laughs> yeah, said no one in the field ever. How do we handle it? Expect the worst. Just be ready if this goes south. It usually does. Yeah, I kind of figured that. That's why I said expect the worst, hope for the best. The I go hot. They haven't spotted us yet. Okay, protect Fisher. Look at other members. Wrong. Shit. They see Fisher. Uh. Hey, Dick. Okay, so far I'm doing fine. Where's the other dude? Okay, we're good. Okay. Well, I'm alive. That's something. Fisher, you okay? I'll live. I thought I was a goner. I knew they weren't a the friendly sword. Well, we tried. We did our best. Not like they gave us much of a choice. They didn't. So we reload and put it behind us. Exactly. <sighs> We still don't even know what they wanted. Not every race we're going to encounter is going to be friendly. We're the aliens here. Who says we'd even understand? Or they'd understand us? It's a new galaxy. I guess it's too much to expect they'll play by Milky Way rules. Or Probably rules not. Look them. But what did we do to them? Only thing I know for sure, their guns hit just as hard as ours. Uh, yeah. Where are the others? Gone. Kirkland and Greer went looking for help. Come on. Well, let's hope they're still alive. Can you move? Oh, oh goody. Can you guys push ahead and look for the others. You, you gonna be ready and safe and fine yeah. and not have any problems? Just ride out of here and take a few more of them out while you're at it. Mm, plan to. Whoa. Take a look at these bodies. What are these things? I'm on fire somehow. Okay, I don't remember the okay. finder. We'll find them. Okay, scan. We might want to scout around first. You're the recon specialist. Point the way. <laughs> scan. Well, I don't have Sam here, but I can try to make sense of it. Organic life form, unknown composition, kind of uncatalogued life form. Uh, Sam, currently offline. Okay. Idea, huh? I had to scan for a second. Research points. Research points centered on new. Unlock new weapons. Okay. Search the shuttle wreckage for supplies. See one thing here. I'll take that, thank you. Container. Take all. Thank you. That does not look good at fucking all. Can't have that, okay. Where am I going? Yeah, I'm supposed to go that way. And if I go this way, what happens? Do I get electrocuted? Hear that? Is that Kirkland? What's in battle? They shot him! Take them out! Right behind you! Good to know, buddy. They wanna fight! I count one left to go! Come on, buddy. Okay, we're good. That's the last of them. I can't believe we're doing this. The cops can make it. Salmon. Um, I'll just take it. Check on Kirkland. No vital signs. Just shot him in cold blood. He was trying to surrender. Why kill him? Would we treat them any different if they showed up on Earth, armed to the teeth? Uh, maybe not. Peace isn't going to be an option here. No, doesn't look like it. Of course, who knows? Maybe they are the bad guy. You never we'll know. Back for his body once we... Okay. 
Okay. Assault rifle. Find the others. Pope Chris, Ooh, the hello, somewhere. beautiful. Still, take a look at this architecture. This is really something. Okay. Can I scan anything? Well, I can scan him. Newman, records, Ratchet and Kirkland Dusley, Andromeda, Initiative, no vital signs, severe ballistic trauma detected. Sam's currently offline. Okay, I guess there's nothing else around here to scan. Ooh. Gee. Scan. I've seen Unclassified, unknown material, age 300, 400 like years old. At least three or four Approximate. Old. The ox left okay. 600 years ago, right? Yeah. Our long. Okay, now this is weird. Unknown material. These readings, I have no idea what it does. Status illumination. Illumination detected. Okay. If that's even possible, evolution separated from ours by two million light years. Mm-hmm. Spooky when you put it that way. Well, everything's spooky here, so what's the difference? Hear that? I wish I did. Oh, oh running away! What is this thing? I think it wants to eat. Okay. Okay, it's dead. Whatever it was. How did it It's organic. No sign of technology. Wow. So. Oh, well, good to know. Biological. Yeah. Weird. Unknown life form. Okay. That's scary. I don't like this. This is spooky. Hey, look, flares going up over there. Could be our people. I'll mark the nap point. Okay. Okay, gear. What do you suppose is down there? New and painful ways to die. Maybe we could jump jet our way across. Is that sound coming from below? Um, alien gods of the underworld? <laughs> don't say that. Uh -huh. I think it's machinery. You can feel the vibration. Oh, the scale of this. Who built it? Alien gods. <laughs> alien gods, of course. That's uh, that's your answer. Oh, the shelf didn't crash down here. Ryder, more of those aliens ahead. Oh, I see him. They see us. Here we go. Not much for talking, are they? Okay. Look out! They're using those animals. Careful! I noticed. We're cloaking. This is for Kirkland. Okay, you're dead. You hanging? Don't worry about me! Come on, buddy. Die, 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 die. Okay, alive. Okay. That did it. <laughs> that did oh, something. You're pretty good at this, Ryder. I was Not really. I dug up Prothean artifacts. Well... This will be a field day for you. Field day, yeah, what really. We're doing here. Crash some kind. It's not one of our ships. Remains. Ooh, incendiary ammo. Yes, please. I like to set things on fire. Let's see anything else around here? I'm not need to look at. Hmm. Ryder, some sort of cave over there. Yeah, I see it. Okay, let's go look in this cave really quick. Check that out. Now this looks more like the golden world my dad was expecting. Scan. If it's anything unknown like plants plant. back in the Milky Way, there are signs of cellular mutation. It's lasted this long. Guess that makes it the Alpha Tree, huh? Yeah. What happened to all its friends outside? Fuck is this? Dead animal in here. Some sort of trap. Pretty recent, too. You suppose those aliens set it? If 
they did, they don't play nice with anyone. Yeah, well, maybe this looks song. like it. Let's go back over here. A quick look, see. Okay, unknown alien transport it's food, thing. I think. Can't be local. Not growing anything on this planet. So maybe they're bringing it in from off world. More of them in the cluster. Not loving that. Yeah, I'm not either. Let's just keep going. Let's see what other interesting things can we find. Fuck's this? What is this? Pretty serious looking operation. Do I want to go in here? Seems like a bad idea. Hmm. What do you think is going on over okay. there? Don't know, but no way we're getting past that fence. We should back up. Our people okay. are missing. What if they're in there? Can't do anything about. Looks like a way out. Let's make it quick. Oh, nobody notices. Yeah, let's hope. Get the console. Ooh. Where are we? Figured I'd double check. There's something over this way. Locate to find her team. Find her team. Hostile aliens. Cora, we got your back. They're trying to pin us down. Doing a good job of it too. Try to light them up. I'm on it. Loading. Pick your targets. Plenty of those. Okay, we're loading. We did it. Look at that. Okay, let's take this. Nice to see you guys. You too, Harry. Gonna level up. How is everyone? Still in one piece. You got here just in time. Thanks. Where's my dad? He went scouting ahead while we fixed the shuttle. Ryder, there's weapons and ammo at the shuttle. Stock up. Okay, plan to. Did things try talking to you at all? Barely a word. Then start. Just start okay. shooting. What about you? Same here. We didn't stop for a chat. Okay, um. Let's look the codex first. Uh. Oh my god, this is a lot. I'll read a couple things and then we'll move on. 
Uh, Sam officially designated a simulated ad adaptive matrix. Sam, I am an artificial intelligence that acts as a coordinating element between Pathfinder, Alec Ryder, and the rest of his team. My quantum processing power is used to conduct on the spot scans of alien worlds assisting in scientific study or tactical sit or tactical situations and monitor the team's weapons and equipment. I am physically located on Arc Hyperion in secure server banks collectively known as SAM Node. While my primary connection is to Alec Ryder via a neural implant, I effectively serve as a mission computer for all team members during Pathfinder operations. I also collect and analyze data for nu from numerous sources and compile compile it for later study. I am tasked with authoring uh, authoring and updating the Pathfinder team codex based on available information and discoveries as they are made. <clears throat> Scott Ryder, born your younger twin on the Citadel space station in 2163. Scott grew up knowing the station was gateway to the entire Milky Way. In his orientation interview, he claims his foster this fostered a longing to step through those gateways to adventure. Well, with informal training aided by Alec Ryder and Seven's background, Scott joined the Systems Alliance military and was assigned to an outpost near uh, Arcturus Station overseeing Relay 202, a primary route to Arcturus. This mass relay leads in, into contested space and has an unsavory reputation. Scott was needed to protect Ar Arcturus, but has had a front first seat to everyone else going off to fortune and glory. When Alec Ryder was dishonorably discharged due to his AI research, internal memos show that this also effectively ended Scott's career, making Andromeda a more attractive option for the adventure he sought. On arrival in Andromeda, Scott's uh, cryopod was damaged and his revival process interrupted. Dr. Lexi uh, advised keeping him in medically induced coma to allow him to awaken naturally. Alec Ryder... Put on Earth in 2129, Alec Ryder says his love of new frontiers was fostered by childhood in Sierra Nevadas. According to his service record, he joined the Alliance military and was eventually assigned to John Grimson's historic expedition through the uh, Caron Relay. <clears throat> his experience made him a candidate for what would later be known as N7 training back on Earth, where he met Dr. Ellen Harlow. After their marriage, Alec continued military service, most notably on uh, shang -Chi and the first contact war against the Turians. Assigned as a military to attache to the Citadel in the late 2160s, Alex, Alec became interested in artificial intelligence as a means of human advancement. His pursuit of this illegal technology led to a dishonorable discharge from the Alliance military. Contacted by the Andromeda Initiative, Alex Alec found a sponsor to help complete his work. I am the product of that research, assisting only, not only the initiative, but Alec's new role as a pathfinder. Cora Harper. <clears throat> Lieutenant Cora Harper, service number, blah, blah, blah. Some, is a human biotic and formerly an officer in the Systems Alliance military. Her screening interviews state she was raised in poverty on an independent cargo freighter, joining the Alliance at 18 to obtain training for her powerful biotic abilities. However, Cora claims her superior saw her talents as a liability supported, supported by test scores showing her abilities to spike at abnormally high levels. She was transferred via the Citadel Council's Valkyrie program uh, and placed within the Asari Commando Unit Talon's Daughters. Though the activities of Sari Huntresses are typically sealed for 5,000 years, Quir has freely shared her experience on the record peacekeeping, counterterrorism, and hunting fugitives. When she left uh, Talon's Daughters for the Andromeda Initiative, no reason is recorded. Quir's Huntress training and biotic capability made her, made her a capable made her a candidate for Alex Ryder's second in command and, if warranted, his successor as Pathfinder. Okay, cool. Nice to know that about her. Liam Costa is a human security and crisis response specialist with civilian tactical training. His screening interview states that he was born on Earth, but his parents specialized in interplanetary policy law and the family moved frequently. Their primary residence was split between London and the Citadel. Liam entered university for engineering, but left to train for law enforcement. Though initially driven, he was only briefly stationed as a police officer and 
described leaving as a necessary move for all concerned, he transferred to the multi-species effort of heavy urban search and crisis response. If Liam was disillusioned in law enforcement service records show that there was not merit in crisis response, the human cognate contingent heavy urban search ter terrain one reported that Liam performed uh, exceptionally in all conditions. Liam says that this is when he learned of the Andromeda Initiative after meeting former Alliance personnel at a post post hostility relief action. His multidisciplinary skills set him apart and Liam had, was handpicked by Alec Ryder to support the Pathfinder team. Dr. Ellen Ryder, Ellen Ryder, was a pioneer and designer of biotic implants in the 2150s. She was leading biomedical and cybernetic research at UFRJ in Rio de Janeiro when human biotics began to emerge as a scientific field. Ellen found possible applications for her work in neuro-integrated wet wetware. Early designs were biotic implants formed the framework for later L2 and L3 models. Ellen met, Ellen met Alec Ryder when he was posted to Rio for ICT N7 training for the first contact war. She eventually joined Alec on the Citadel when he was posted there as a military attache and gave birth to fraternal twins on the station in 2163. Unfortunately, element zero, the catalyst for biotic mutations, is a hazardous material, material, material poorly understood in the early years of human biotics. After repeat accidental exposure, Alan eventually developed a terminal neurodegenerative disease, later known as AEMD. Uh, in her final years, Ellen Ryder built what would later become the Pathfinder implants designed to sync, to sync with the AI par partner Alec Ryder was developing. Ellen died before my creation was fully realized. That's sad. Oh dear lord. Mmm. Well, I did this in the last Mass Effect, so I might as well do this in this one, too. Brainchild of the visionary billionaire Garrison, the Andromeda Initiative, was conceived as Garrison's personal dream and desire to prove humanity's capabilities beyond the military power demonstrated in the first contact war. Garrison officially began planning the initiative in 2172, announcing her ambitious, ambitious goal of launching a pioneering colonization effort to Andromeda within 20 years. Internal reports showed the struggles at the early inactive phase initiative phase. However, Garrison's personal stake and enthusiasm sustained the initiative er until the early 2180s, when after a sudden flux of investment and new marketing strategy, interest in the initiative grew afresh. Construction of the arcs were completely completed rapidly thereafter, and the Andromeda Initiative officially launched in 2185. The initiative's mission statement is to bridge Andromeda and the Milky Way, create a sustainable, inclusive civilization, and push scientific development forward by centuries. In official literature, Garrison characterizes the initiative as count continuing the search for humans next horizon. Golden worlds are planets in Andromeda's Helios cluster that are either the strongest possible candidate for settlement or whose resources could bolster the initiative's chances at long-term survival. Based on survey data and long-term projections, some are believed to be gold garden worlds capable of supporting life. Others are mineral treasure troves that could supply fledgling colonies with vital resources. These worlds were designed designated habitats 1 through 7. While not generally used in planetary surveying, the term golden world was coined by the Andromeda Initiative's marketing team and has stuck ever since. Lenisha's early settlement strategy revolves around these golden worlds. The Ark cannot sustain a population stasis indefinitely, and the Nexus requires vast quantities of refined ore, helium-3, water, ice, and an element zero. On the ground, Pathfinder surveys are essential to confirming quickly that the golden worlds are sustainable for outposts okay i don't need this i don't want this i'm not reading this Founded the Andromeda Initiative, Garrison was one of humanity's wealthiest, wealthiest and most eccentric entrepreneurs in the Milky Way. Her business interests were wide-ranging as she made her fortune from investments in a myriad of technology-related fields. Always a maverick, 
It was her vision of traveling to a new galaxy and set the Andromeda Initiative in motion. Ignoring skeptics and naysayers, Garrison spent vast sums of money building or acquiring the necessary technology and ships to make the long voyage possible. It was a private venture, entirely funded by Garrison, so as to remain free from any government oversight. In 2185, Garrison began the long journey to Andromeda aboard the, the support hub Nexus in speech given on... In a speech given on the eve of departure, she remarked in the co collective knowledge and history represented by the arcs, we carry on these things like the honed tools of an artist to our great empty caves, canvas, to our great empty canvas. To Andromeda, we go to paint our masterpiece. Garrison is slated to serve as the overall leader of the initiative upon arrival. Okay. Uh, intergalactic travel was a topic of ex extranet discussion in the Milky Way for centuries. Several Sari or Solarian led expeditions were proposed over the years, but petered out due to lack of interest, insufficient funds, or engineering hurdles. The Andromeda Initiative's use of AI, like myself, allowed many of the te technological problems to be solved, but invited disapproval from the Turian hierarchy and the Systems Alliance. Building a fleet of dreadnought sized arcs. With private funding, require delicate negotiations with the Citadel Council and the advanced technology essential to survive in Andromeda was often acquired by unorthodox means. Official initiative records show the Nexus departed first in 2185, escorted by a small squadron of fighters for protection, followed by four arcs that comprised the initial launch wave. Additional vessels were in development, including a Quarian lead ship accommodating multiple species by construction was but construction was slow due to their diverse requirements and the second launch wave was delayed. Initiative observers remain optimistic. Role of a Pathfinder. Pathfinders are the tip of the spear for exploring new worlds, while planetary surveying is typically a long-term multiple team multi-team process the initiative found an alternative thanks to alec Ryder, ai research and an individual equipped with the best training and technology available an ai partner that can run complex studies in seconds and 100 test simulations a minute with ai support pathfinders can determine within hours whether a planet is suitable for habitation and direct the nexus as to what colonist block stands the best chance there pathfinders are trained to improve the viability of potential planets, initiate first contact with unknown species for suitable outpost sites, and handle any external threats before the first colonist touches soil. The presence of a pathfinder is a resort. Reassurance that a planet can be settled safely and with the high expectation of success. Okay. Cool. Hmm. We'll do more later. Okay, I have stuff for weapons, consumables, combat. Okay, this is my leveling up. Your squad has leveled up. Upgrade riders' combat abilities by purchasing combat technology or biotics. Mm, I guess do, do, do this. Impressive shot. Barricade. Turbocharged chip mine. Pistol, assault rifle. Want to learn that. Two points. That cost me two points. Shotgun, sniper rifles, combat fitness, combat tools. I'll take some more max health. Um, Special training allows you the user to expand wheel, jump jets, and melee weapons in combat. To this. Okay. Confirm. Liam level up. Defense. 
Let's improve his defense. Okay, that's good for now. Confirm. That's taken care of. We got these. I'll fiddle with this later. I'll read more of that later. Party ops. Okay, that's fine. Okay, skills. Inventory. Codex is still on the left set. Okay. I'm gonna go back to the game. There we are. Okay, well, what's this? Weapons cache. Yeah, thank you. This way? Ah, uh, hell! Enemy ship on the way! Get to cover! Go, go! Oh, goody. Here they come! They got fools to try and airdrop. Okay, reloading. Ah, lightning zapped their shuttle. How do I heal? Okay, I'm healing. Man, these guys know how to fight. Where is where is you? Ah, damn shrapnel. Okay. Damn, they won't let up. Okay, hide for a second. No. Sound off! I'm here! Still alive! Here! Present! Reloading. I can't get a beat on those things! Okay. There's too many of them! Just keep firing! We can do this! Here we are. Loading. Okay. Come on, dude. Okay, well, I went a little too nuts. That's fine. Goodness, dude. Enemy ship on the way! Get to cover! Go, go! Here they come! They got bulls to try and air. Yeah, I'd say. Don't let up! Ha! Lightning's out their shuttle! 
Okay. Heads up! Another shuttle incoming! In this weather? Guess we got their attention. Are Ooh. those dogs? No. I wish. They've got some weird cloaking ability. You're shitting me! Reload. Okay. There, we got it this time. Just took me a minute. Liam, enough. Right. It's just these assholes kill Kirkland. Calm down. I hear you, but this isn't the time to lose our cool. Now I feel better. Uh. What about the others? Fisher's wounded but sitting tight. No sign of Greer. And our shuttle's in pieces. Guys. She's been hit. What the fuck is that? Take cover! Take cover! Well, that was cool. I didn't know you were biotic. Don't worry, it's not contained. I did. Before they attacked, I... I managed to fix our comms. You're a lifesaver. Now just take it easy. Sam, are you there? QEC link established. Affirmative, Ryder. The Pathfinder needs to speak with you. Good to see you in one piece. What's our status? Liam and I are with Cora. We have wounded crew. The good news is our shuttle's been repaired. We can get back to the Ark. Not with these storms. It's too risky to fly. Our wounded need help. Our wounded can't wait much longer. Do you have something in mind? If the storm is the problem, then let's solve the problem. We're talking about weather. And I have an idea about that. Rendezvous with my coordinates will... Damn, they spotted me. Sir? Sir! Can you two manage alone? I can keep her stable. For a while. Let's move. Sam, do you have the Pathfinder's position? Marking okay. the nav point on your map. Doesn't look far. Let's make this quick. What about Griff? If he didn't turn up by now, nothing we can do. The Pathfinder's all that matters. What was my dad scouting for? He was trying to get readings on that tower. Well, the network puts him near it. Exercise caution. The storm front is already gaining intensity. Nice to have you back, Sam. How about some good news? Hello, next time? Sam. I'll collect that. Thank you. Ryder, your dad was in trouble. We have to find him. Yeah, I know. That doesn't change the fact that I'm gonna loot. Okay. Okay. Well, then what way do you want me to go? Ryder, your dad was in trouble. We oh, have to shut find up. We've got to find the Pathfinder. 
Mike, right now. Okay, let's go this way. I guess. Hi, Dad. Sir. Stay low. Okay, that makes sense. Uh, I was right. Ships. It was bringing food in. It wasn't local. Good work. You actually did some scouting. That's what I was trained for. Wouldn't be much of a recon specialist if I didn't. <laughs> well, you're off to a good start. Baptism by fire. Mm-hmm. Sir, you said you had an idea about Exactly. The it's the dark energy cloud the Hyperion hit. It's affecting the whole planet, interfering with that. The tower is caught in okay. the clouds. Together, they're disrupting the entire climate with undirected energy. It would explain a cave we found. Plant life sheltered from the storm, from that tower. It's a good bet. Okay. And I think so I was correct. And shut the tower down. The lightning goes away. And the shuttle can get us out of here. In theory, we just have to get past them. Well, then let's do it. It's a hell of a gamble, but we won't know until we get in there and try. Exactly. No illusions about this. It'll be a nasty fight the whole way. If the riders are game, so am I. But we risk turning a skirmish with these guys into something worse. It's them or us. Exactly. Oh, it's them. The problem is we're outnumbered. I've been working on that. We just need to change the math. Twitchy Templar! Good evening! Welcome. Oh, fuck. Well, that was smart. Tink. Oh, that's so cool. What's for me? <laughs> me too. I'm not going to be picky. You're not a bad guy, sorry. Get into that building. We don't want to get bogged down out here. Loading. This one's south okay, of the that was good. Up. They're coming out of the woodwork. That was a cool move. He thinks tight, don't get separated. Go, 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 go! Sam, buy so out of here and here. Keep the momentum up. Don't let him get the drop on you. Come Stay on, pop your pretty head out. Have to keep an eye on our flank. Not if we keep moving forward. Don't let him catch us. 
Yep, I agree. We're here. How's your dad doing all of this? Ready? I don't know, because my dad's a badass, I guess. Oh, fuck me. That's it. We're doing it. How much farther? Where are we going? All the way to the top. And then what? We'll know when we get there. Good. Nice to know. Container. We took that, thank you. I'll take this, thank you. Almost fried me. Mm. Oh my god. That's Greer on the table. They killed Is him. it? Oh my Try god. To back for him. Have to keep pushing ahead. Well fuck. That's not good. Container, I'll take that. Okay, I guess that's it. Sam, give me engineer profile. Okay, so I can break glass. That's a cool little thing. Sir, where are you getting these profiles? Little help from Sam. What does that mean? Just focus on the fight. Um, okay. The storm's getting worse. We'll lose our chance if we don't beat it. Come on! Okay. We're almost there. This looks like a control center. Keep him off my back. You heard him. We made it. In one piece. Not over yet. I need to get through that door over there. Come on, buddy. Thank you for dying. We're good. I'll just take all your shit. Thank you. Uh, what? Now! I need to decipher the language. Okay, I'm collected. Well, while Dad's doing that, we best protect him. There's more coming up. What's the plan here? Which direction? Us in no time. We need to defend both sides, or they'll flank us. Okay. Sex door to squad mates. Okay. Moving. So you're C to give them orders individually. Right. Okay. Got it. Watch it. Think I see movement. We held them off at the shuttle. We can do it again. A lot of people still counting on us. I'm just getting warmed up. They mean business. Keep them off your dad. Okay. Possible inputs. 25% decrypted. Hurry. We don't have long. I don't know, but they sure want it back. Well, fifty percent decrypted. It's an unusually complicated syntax. I can see that. Try a recursive search. I will need a moment to evaluate the pattern. We only have a moment. Do it. I think I really pissed that one off. Ouch! Maybe because I shot him in the face. I'll help her. Sir, any progress? Decryption is 75% complete. We've almost got it. Just a little longer! They're falling back! Could be regrouping for another push. Stay okay. sharp. Decryption complete. That did it. It's a security override. I'll try to open the door from here. Ah, damn, it's jammed. I need to take Of course it is. Well, the game's pretty good so far. Ammo collected. Ryder, I need your help over here. 
Okay, Go, I'm coming, Dad. I'm coming. We need to get this door open. Put your back into it. You really think we can shut this thing down? I don't know yet. Oh, who knows? Sam's decoded part of the language. Now we'll see if I can have a conversation. With who? Who do you plan on talking to? More like what? I think it's automated. Oh. I think that's good news, maybe. Come on. These are the moments that make it all worthwhile. Uh, sure, Dad. Thanks. Sam, begin translating. A moment. Indexing. That's fucking cool. Let's see what we have. Oh my god, that's fucking cool. That's interesting. Did we do good? The music in this game is beautiful. Proof we can succeed. This is more than hope. It's proof we weren't crazy. We can fly to a whole new galaxy and still make sense of things. Sam had a little something to do with it. Well, it yeah, that's a true. Of linguistics, though I am pleased to have it. Have helped? Yeah, we're pleased to. Um, Sam? What the fuck is that? Oh shit. Um. That's bad. Repeat. We need an emergency extraction now. They're spinning up the shuttle. ETA is three, maybe four minutes. We don't have that long. Don't you dare tell me that he's gonna take his helmet off and give me his so he can he can save his daughter's life? No! You bastard! <laughs> Did he just say I love you? Oh. We did just have a nice moment. What the fuck, game? You bastards! You know, not everybody needs to have a tragic fucking backstory. What is happening? What is happening? What is happening? Is this our neurons dying? Are we mutating? What the fuck is happening? Great. Good. Um. Um. Well, I do think this is maybe our neurons firing. Are we experiencing brain death and, you know, seeing our our life flash before our eyes? If so, that's a really fucking cool thing. Sam, what's the reading? Ryder's implant is overloading. I suggest a hardwire connection. Do it! There! You wanna bet that the brother wakes up now? Now that dad's gone? Welcome back. What happened? You were clinically dead for 22 seconds. I fucking called it. What about the others? <sighs> Did the rest of the team make it? Hey. No dad. You're still with us. Guys. Get to Sam Node. Riders awake. Who are you talking to? Sam. 
You don't hear him? I didn't hear him. You're up. Oh, lovely. Okay? Dad transferred Sam to us. And here? My father. God damn it. Where? Of course Dad's dead. Gee, thank you. It was your life or his. And he chose you. Gee! Nice to know. I'm so sorry. Not as sorry as me! I'm gonna be sad. Because I feel fucking bad. This can't be happening. I... I can't believe he's gone. One minute, everything was fine, and then... He... Exactly. Tragic be beginning distant, arc is complete. But he once said that when his time came, he wanted to go out among stars no one had seen before. I don't give a shit! Stop trying what to be poetic! Sam, node? Sam is now part of you. In a way we don't I noticed. entirely understand. It played havoc with your brain. What did? Sam? Your father authorized the transfer of Pathfinder to authority to you. Shouldn't that be Cora? In theory. In reality, you're the new Pathfinder. Well, we don't really have a choice here, so I can't well, really whine. Well, if that's how it has to be. Don't sell yourself short. I think you can do it. Aren't you a sweetheart, Liam? It's what he wanted. I won't stand in the way. But being Thank Pathfinder you, is a serious job. You sure you're ready for this? Mm, Dad already decided it's in my blood. I have to be. Dad already decided it's in my blood. It's in my blood. It's why I'm here. Exploring the unknown. Just like your dad, huh? Yep. It's Just all like that. It's anyway. Sam's linked to your mind on a deeper level now. Okay. Trying to untangle fun. it could kill you. Okay, I know this fun. Is tough, but we need to start thinking about the next step. A lot of people are counting on us. Is the Ark still drifting? That's the thing. Whatever your dad did with that tower, it saved the day. Some sort of atmosphere scrubber. The energy cloud I called out. it! I knew the that those fuckers now. were colonizers that beat us to the planet. First. I knew it! She has two hours. We'll need our Pathfinder for this. Okay, thanks. Okay, so let's recap. Dad oh, died. Uh, I checked on your brother. Still no change. Fuck. But if you can pull through, so can he. <laughs> but if your dad I can't. Both of you. I can't say no to that one. I can't disagree with that your one. So will be fine. Missed. What's going on, Sam? This is our private channel. I shared it with him. Okay. Recap. We get to the planet. Planet's all fucked. Dad died. Right after having a good moment. And we're stuck with exactly. Good old try to remove X would kill you. Hey, the perfect trifecta. Tragic backstory. Something's in danger. It's apocalypse level bullshit. And we're now upgraded technically. Voila! Look at that. <laughs> hey. Um, I mean, I don't think you really had a fucking choice in picking us, so what channel? He never mentioned anything about that. It allowed me to know him better. Alec wouldn't want us to lose sight of the goal. He said pain emboldens our resolve. He'd insist we grow stronger from his passing. Sure. Yes, we'll grow stronger. Of course, we probably don't have a mourning period either, so that's great. Achievement unlocked, Pathfinder. Oh, I bet they're pissed. I guess I'm on somebody's shit list now. Oh, don't you look cool. Mr. Space Demon looking motherfucker. Okay, if that's not evil, I don't know what is. Hmm. 
What do you have? Yeah, I guess so. The evil, evil aliens look cool, I'll give them that. Oh goody. Okay, cool. So we got pissed off Halo Boy after us. Good to know. Ryder, good to see you on your feet. We're at the Nexus. It's the forward hub for the entire Andromeda Initiative. The Asari, Solarian, and Turian Arcs should be there, too. Awesome! That's good. Let's hope they've had better luck. I bet you they Ragnar haven't. Approach now. It's almost as big as the Citadel back home. Nexus Control, this is Arc Hyperion, requesting docking clearance. Captain, I'm only getting their automated approach channel. Not a live person. Well, like it or not, we're here. Take us in. How much you want to bet they're all dead? Construction should have been finished by now. Could be worse. How? Habitat 7's a bust. We might have started a war with the first aliens we met, and our Pathfinder's dead. This better be rock bottom. Green across the board. Docking initiated. No, it's not. Trust me. Things can always get worse. Always. There's right. no rock bottom. There's just a I fucking abyss. You. Good luck, Pathfinder. Oh, I bet there's gonna be a horror element. Oh, lovely. Are you okay, Ryder? Captain just called me Pathfinder. This is really happening. Just take a deep breath. Can I explore? I still can't Can I explore and steal shit? Can I explore and steal shit? But now it's yours. You just need to decide need what you're gonna do with it. Where do I start? I'm just not sure I'm ready. We weren't ready to fall out of the sky on Habitat 7. But we survived that. Right? Yeah, by sheer fucking so, dumb luck. Let's keep a jump chat handy. Container, thank you. I'll take that. Messy boo boo boo. Okay, folks. This is what we've been waiting for. Okay, up here. Let's go see what bad things await me in this hellscape. Okay, let's go. It'll be nice to see some friendly faces this time. I don't think they're going to be friendly. Just enough to finish building the station and provide safe harbor for the Arcs. It means we can start waking our people up. I don't think that's a good idea. Gotta have champagne for the welcome party. You're expecting one. After what we've been through, I could use a buzz. I could use more welcome. than a buzz. Yeah. Rough ride so far. Mm, you betcha. Real food and a shower are just ahead. I doubt that. Here we are. <laughs> Uh, I don't see any champagne. Where is everybody? It's a ghost ship. Butter rate. 
Well, this can't be right. Great. It's like great, everything's great, great, on great, standby. Great, 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 my code is limited to information and simple interaction simulation. Please select from the following pre-programmed responses. Nexus. What is the Nexus? The Nexus serves as the central hub for the Andromeda Initiative's colonization efforts. It is the first destination for all colonists upon their arrival in the new galaxy. Please enjoy the many venues the Nexus has to offer. As the station expands, it will one day serve as the seat of government for Milky Way colonists. Providing a safe, stable, and prosperous environment is our primary goal. Not from Not, the looks of it. Yep, exactly. He took the words right out of my mouth. Um, Andromeda Galaxy. What can you tell me about the Andromeda Galaxy? Here in Andromeda, you are over two million light years away from the Milky Way Galaxy. This is the furthest any life form has ever traveled outside our home system, making you a brave pioneer indeed. The Nexus itself is located in a region known as the Helios Cluster. Here, you and thousands of your fellow colonists will fulfill your dreams of settling a new home. Fortune awaits. Um, living arrangements. Where do colonists live? Once you've cleared immigration, our helpful staff will assist you in choosing the home world of your dreams. Will it be the tropical paradise of Habitat 7, the gentle rolling hills of Habitat 3, or perhaps the mysterious twilight world of Habitat 5? Whichever I'll take gentle rolling hills, thank you. Our pathfinders have carefully vetted all colony worlds to ensure your security and prosperity. Oh boy. Habitat 7? That's where we landed, she's way out of date. Yeah, I fucking noticed. Yep, exactly. We're we're hitting all the tropes so far. Immigration. How does the immigration process work? We ask that you submit to a brief medical exam to ensure your health and well-being after making such a long journey. Once you've been cleared, our colonization experts will assist you in finding your new home. Please be mindful of the queue. Thousands of eager colonists like you are waiting to begin their new life in Andromeda. Um, no. Uh, uh, where? Place is deserted. Current year. What year is it? The current year is 2819. After spending over 600 years in stasis, it's normal to feel disoriented or confused upon arrival. Our helpful medical staff can assist with any physical or psychological after effects you may be experiencing. Well, she's got the date right. At least. Yeah, so that's the only everyone? fucking thing she's got right. That's all. Ah, <sighs> fun. My Please see one of our helpful immigration staff for further assistance. And welcome to your new home in Andromeda, where the brightest star is you. Oh, aren't the you cute? Processing is unknown error. Right. That was helpful. Mm hmm. Very. So very helpful. Sure wish I could fucking see better. Plants are still alive. Well, that's something. I don't fucking trust any of this shit. It's like they didn't finish building it. How much you wanna bet that everybody got kidnapped? Hello? Don't do that! In any horror situation, you do not fucking say hello into the darkness. This place should be packed with people. That'd be cool if it was like a dream. Hi there. Who the fuck are you? Where is everybody? We're from Arc Hyperion, and wondering where everybody went. Did he hear you? Did you say an Arc? I did. Yeah, we just got in. And for what it's worth, your VI over there could use an update. We thought you were all dead. What? Hey, look, I'm... Or I knew it! Or lost in dark space, or... But you're here. You have no idea how much this means. 
I don't believe it. Hello, Tyrion. I'm Tyrion Candros. I lead our militia on the Nexus. Cool. I'm Ryder. This is Cora Harper and Liam Costa, part of the Pathfinder team. I'm sorry for the confusion. Our sensors told us an arc had arrived, but Helios is notorious for scrambling equipment. We thought you were just another malfunction. Why is that? But aren't you expecting us? You're the first arc we've seen. After a year of waiting and yeah, no I suspect the others, that too. We shuttered this area and stopped looking. You've been stranded for a whole year? Longer. I'll fill you in on the way to Op Center. Well, that's bad. Everything that could go wrong with our plan has. Yeah. We arrived fucking 14 bit. months ago. Right away, we hit a band of dark energy that knocked us off course. We're familiar with it. Mm-hmm. Then you'll know why we call it the Scourge. We lost whole sections of the station. A lot of people died. No power, That's no bad. food. The chaos went on for months. It finally led to armed rebellion. When order was restored, the insurgents were banished. Exiles, we called them. Are things That's back great. To normal? Not even close. But you're here now, so maybe the worst is over. Nope. Nope, never say that. The worst is not over, honey. Pathfinders? No word from anyone, period. Any threats from the locals? So far, we've stayed hidden. We're in no shape to deal with an attack. Yeah, we can tell. We had a first contact situation on Habitat 7. Whole thing went south. They tried to kill us. That wasn't first contact. We know about them. Those aliens are going to be a real problem. Oh, I bet. This day just keeps getting... We're here. <laughs> you guys go ahead. I'll check out the security situation. You should know our command structure has been fractured. Some of us are filling in for leaders who died. Is That's it sad. They said drop everything and report for duty. And no one was expecting an arc to finally show up. Feel Stop bad for all of them. The board. Stand by to merge Hyperion power into the grid. The crew of the Hyperion. Good luck. Thanks, we'll need it. I'm Jaren Tan, director of the initiative. You have no idea how much your arrival means to us. We're here to assist. We've heard about what happened, and we're ready to help. We could use any supplies you have. Food, water, we're short on everything. This is Foster Addison. She oversees colonial affairs. Where's the Pathfinder? You're I'm at the her. Pathfinder. You're not Alec Ryder. He's My dead. My father's dead. He made me his successor. Alec is dead. Yes, he is. Please understand, the entire initiative is at risk. I could, I could fucking None tell. None of the Golden Worlds panned out. They're a bust, and there's been no word from the other arcs. What happened to them? Unknown. Our supplies are nearly depleted. Rationing bought us some time, but even that's running out. We need no, to find more we're sources. Fucked. But that takes people, and we can't wake them up. Until well, I guess I'm gonna to be a one-woman army. Golden world. Now more than ever, we need a pathfinder. Well, you Enough got me, you, and I'm new to the job. Are you up to the task? You fucking betcha. Yeah, well, I'm ready. I'm ready to step up and do what needs to be done. I can handle it. Youthful enthusiasm will only get you so far in Andromeda. Will you That's shove that up your ass? Guest. Thank you. I'm Nakmore Kesh, superintendent of this station. I hope they haven't scared you off already. Not it's yet. personal, but now isn't the time for on-the-job training. Fuck you. The Pathfinder here seems willing to try. We could Thank use you. a fresh perspective. You've heard my concerns. I'll leave you to it. We're all feeling the pressure. No shit. Let's have a private word in my office, Ryder. We'll discuss giving you a scout ship. Thank you. I'm happy to work out the details with your associate. Welcome to the Nexus. Thanks for helping. Thank you for standing up for me there. Mm, hopes in short supply here. 
What little we can find should have a chance to Ma'am, the Hyperion's core is now online. Let me show you something. An hour ago, that was all Exactly, gone. I agree with, with you. With power from your ship, you're keeping the lights on. You have my vote. Thank you, dear. And when the power runs out? You'd best go talk to Director Tan. Make sure that doesn't happen. We'll and figure it out. Shy. Come see me when you have a chance. Oh, I won't. Trust me. Oh, more things to read in my journal later to you guys. That'll be fun. So many things. What do I do? Is there anything that I can pick up while I'm here? I need to start paying more attention to that. Hmm. See? Container! Could have missed that. Any data pads? Yes, we have some. Same shit, different day. For posterity, in case the initiative goes belly up, Nexus is a four-ring circus. Don't like how Tan operates, and his disdain for the Krogan is obvious. I believe his intentions are ultimately good, but he's an opportunist who's likely to create dissent. I don't see the Nexus coming together if he's left unchecked. It's already polarized Addison. She's taking the cue to circle the wagons. I think I can take top... Talk to Can Candorus about this and at least try to get the two of us more coordinated. Or maybe not. Seriously hate this kind of drama. Fuck. Yeah, me too. Yeah, well. Let's hope you guys can get your shit together. Because if not, we're all fucked here. So, you know. Stop being children. There you are. Hope the others haven't been giving you a hard time. There's a lot that needs doing. At least with the Hyperion hooked up and feeding us power, my team and I can get more work done. Let's talk about the genetic page later. Your job, Nexus problems. Let's start with the Nexus problems. I don't give a fuck about anything what sort else of problems first. Have you seen on the Nexus? Situations gone to shit pretty much sums it up. Ah. There's arcs missing. Some idiots tried to mutiny and take over. Then more idiots offended my clan, so they left. And to top it all off, the founder of the initiative, Gian Garson, was killed. What happened to her? What happened to Gian Garson? Killed in the Scourge disaster. Her and a bunch of the other leaders. Tan might know more. Okay. What about Nexus problems? I thought the Hyperion had it bad when we arrived. Anything else? The outposts aren't happening because we don't have resources or people, so Addison's more uptight than ever. Yeah, I noticed she has a right stick up her butt. Station was damaged on arrival. But that's a detail, according to some. My team and I are repairing what we can. If we don't get materials soon, things will go downhill. Fast. Okay, so materials first, then people. We gotta find a world. Planet. Something. Something good needs to happen to us, or we're all dead. Other question. Your job. What kind of work do you do as superintendent? I was part of the team that originally designed and built this place. So you know I everything. I keep the station functional, or as functional as possible, considering. Uh, whereabouts, Jennifer? Krogan, whereabouts? I guess I should ask that. Yeah, a bit. I notice there aren't a lot of Krogan around. You haven't spoken to number eight yet, have you? What? Number eight? Tan. Ask him why most of my people left. He'll have opinions. Oh, dear God. I can God. tell you this much. When the mutiny happened, a deal was made. Oh, dear my God. My was supposed to settle matters and, in return, get more say in the initiative. What was the deal? Did the deal go through? The clan held up their part, but Tan had a meltdown when he found out we wanted more say around here. Then Addison's assistant, Spender, pretended he never made the deal in the first place. It was a mess, but I don't blame my people for walking out. We're done being used. Honestly, I don't blame you, and I, I'd walk away too. You know, fuck them. 
So why are you still here? With your clan gone, why did you stay? It's complicated. The station and my clan both need me here. So number eight, what is that? Why do you call Tan eight? Because he was eighth in line to take over the Andromeda Initiative. I like to remind him of that now and then. Keep him humble. Mm -hmm. We might just be working together here, honey. Other questions? Genophage. When we left the Milky Way, the Krogan were still dealing with the Genophage. Right. The Genophage. A little gift to our people from the Solarians thousands of years ago. That sterility virus they infected us with left most of our children stillborn. Only one in a thousand survive. State of cure. What about the Krogan here in Andromeda? There's no cure for it. But my clan was starting to show a mutation against the virus. A natural defense. That's During good. the trip to get here, Krogan underwent gene therapies to enhance the mutation while we were in stasis. So you used those 600 years to your advantage. Gave the adaptation more time to develop. Yeah. It's still early, but I think we made a dent. That's a good Our thing. Our scientists say we've improved viability to almost 4%. Which is a lot better than what we had. Beyond all the statistics, it means more Krogan children will live. It's the only way my people have a future out here. Yeah, I agree. And I know about the Slary invol involvement with the Genophage, but I will ask the question for anybody else who does not know. No wonder your people have such a problem with Salarians. Some wounds never heal. Not that my ancestors didn't provoke it. They did try to conquer the galaxy. The Salarians were forced to respond. And it's not fair to blame it all on them, either. The Salarians developed the virus, but it was the Turians who deployed it. I'm hoping that's all in the past. Plenty of blame to go around, but Andromeda is about new beginnings. My people need that more than most. I like you. Very much. I think we're gonna be good friends. You're not a fucking idiot. Okay, I'm done for now. Nothing more for now. Try not to die out there. Don't plan to. Thank you, Cash. Okay, let's go see who else I can find. Mm, information wall. Hello, I'm Gian Garson, founder of the initiative. It's through your hard work that blah, the vision blah, of the blah. you and all your colleagues look around at your achievements. Founder uh, Garson's office is located at workspace not allocated. Good, she's dead. How morbid. <laughs> Nexus status. Integration from the Hyperion is ongoing. Personnel are still restricted to operations. My employee data. You are employee rider. Salary code 19B. Active Pathfinder. Your supervisor is Director Tan. Based on current staffing needs, you will be eligible for paid vacation time in 587 days. Seriously? <laughs> Why not plan on which beautiful colony you'll vacation on while you wait? Hmm, gee, thanks. Selection process, viability status. Viability status. Viable planets capable of supporting life are key to our survival in Andromeda. The viability of a world is affected by several factors, including temperature, resources, threat levels, political stability, and so on. We have okay. few viable planets currently within range. Resource levels are considered at risk. Hmm. Selection process. The selection process saw the Andromeda Initiative evaluate thousands of potential habitable planets within the galaxy. After discovering an unusually high ratio of potential candidates, or Golden Worlds, the Helios Cluster was selected as our destination. Even at a distance, studying the light from stars can reveal much about their planet's composition and atmosphere. Seven That's worlds, cool. nicknamed Habitats, have the life-supporting environments and resources we need to start our new lives in Andromeda. Well, I gotta go find a new one for us. Staff directory. For initiative strategy and pathfinder coordination, please see director Jaron Tan. For colonial affairs or outpost status, please see director Foster Addison. For station maintenance, please contact superintendent Nakmore Kesh. For militia operations or apex deployment, please see Tiran Kandros. 
Why, thank you. Okay, I'm just gonna wander a little bit before I go over there. Strike team missions. Data pad. Lieutenant, based on status report 16C, it seems we're no closer to gaining a foothold in any sector without decent re recon and greater intel on this enemy. I'm starting to think our efforts are futile. The risks involved and continued loss of resources and lives it makes it hard to justify. With morale this low, we need to scale down expectations again. Andros. What the fuck is this? This console reports on the militia's current strike team missions, Pathfinder. Please speak with Tyrion Candros for authorization to participate. What am I going to do? Oh, I played the the first three Mass Effect games, and uh, I had a vote on my my in my YouTube posts, and by popular demand, everybody wanted me to play Mass Effect Andromeda. So. Here we are. That's the console for our strike teams. What are they? Assault and extraction squads. When we need the best, I have Apex, combat experts who've signed up to defend us. Since you have a front row view of the cluster, I can give you authority to dispatch them. Dispatch them for what? What situations should they handle? Protecting civilian outposts, holding key positions, or just distracting the cat. Authorization complete. Good luck out there. Thanks, buddy. Deploy launch ships. Okay, strike teams can be sent on missions to support the Andromeda Initiative. If they succeed, they're an XP, and Ryder will gain a reward. If they fail, they earn only a small amount of XP and no special reward. FX is the most elite strike team in the cluster and handle critical missions. Select mission and press space to send apex your progress will be automatically saved before multiplayer is launched you will then play and play the role of the apex operative in a small squad play apex missions in multiplayer either with friends or through public matchmaking to earn strike team rewards for writer and additional bonuses hey i don't want to play multiplayer Hello? It's not right. It's not fair. What's wrong? Oh my, you're... So it's true. A Pathfinder has found us. There's hope at last. Maybe you could help. You're impartial. This whole thing has gotten so political. My husband. He's locked up and slated for exile. For a crime he didn't commit. What was the crime? What exactly was he convicted of? They don't exile you for petty theft. Well, maybe this bunch would. They say it's murder. They're calling him the first murderer in Andromeda, but the dead man was his friend. He wouldn't have. There are witnesses and evidence, but it's all circumstantial. At worst, it was an accident. His name is Nilkin Rensis. He could give you the details if you were willing to speak with him, please. There might not be time. I'll go talk to I'd him. be happy to. Oh, thank you. I'm sure the jailer will allow you a visit. Please, tell Milken I love him. Okay. Liam! Hey, buddy. Pathfinder. No time for our beer yet. This place is a mess. Security is it. Let's call it strength. I can believe it. Nexus is running on empty. Not just that. A lot of the exiles were security. Everyone was trained and armed for Frontier. We know Ket are dangerous, and now we have to worry about our people too. No idea where they went, but they left mad. Great. Well... No, they might not all be dead. 
I write them off. They were frustrated. If they just wanted to kill, they could have fought to the last here. Apparently, we're the big hope for everyone. Not the Hyperion showing. Just us. I'm with you. It's just... A lot. We'll get it back to spec. As long as the Nexus is here, as long as we're here, we have a job to do. Double down crisis mode. I can do that. We can do that. Ready and willing, Pathfinder. Good to know. Notice the hand off there. Too small for lizards. You'd be surprised. Okay. Still just gonna keep wandering around. I still reckon they had breather gear stowed in Professor Herrick? Perhaps both. Life is infinitely. Oh there, buddy. You must be the Pathfinder. Wonderful. You and your Sam are exactly what we need. Thanks, Mr. Professor Herrick. My colleagues and I will work with your Sam and the data you gather to solve Andromeda's scientific mysteries. Okay. What are your specialities? What fields do you study? Herrick's into life sciences. I do planetary geology, oceanography, rocks and runoff. Aradana's the space and math whiz. Cool. That we've had much to study with everyone cooped up for 14 months. But your data on the Scourge flows like poetry. Now we can better advise on repairing the damage it caused. And maybe Addison will give us a real workspace. Who can think with all this racket? Good God, so many people to talk to. Pathfinder, those bioscans are superb. Could you gather more for our comparative conservation effort? Sure, maybe. What conservation effort? Ah, my thesis is on the console there. Broad strokes, we're comparing and preserving organisms from both galaxies. If you donate more bioscans and samples to the catalog, I can get you a finder's fee. Tempted? Sure. Hi, Pathfinder. Want to hit some rocks for science? <laughs> Try and stop me. Absolutely. What do you need? Sam and I used your scans and made a VI for geophysics surveys. Beta builds on the console there. Test it out in the field, and I'll wrangle you a consultant's bonus from Director Addison. How's that sound? Okay. Pathfinder, we've had some trouble. Anything I can help with? Perhaps. I discharged an away team to get readings from a section of the Scourge that was behaving anomalously. They haven't reported in for some time, and sensors can't locate their shuttle. I sent them out there. Good, dedicated people. I fear what might have happened to them. Hmm. Have hope. Don't give up hope. When I'm out there, I'll see if I can find them. Their friends and family will want to know what's happened. And I... I need to know. Okay. Cool. Oh, good security footage. Kandro says you're aware there was a mutiny aboard the Nexus. During your absence, events escalated quickly, but we believe it began with fire and hydroponics and theft in the armory. Motivations for the uprising, very mob mentality was certainly a factor, but, that. but for the leaders, including your predecessor, former security director Kelly, it was a conscious betrayal. There have been Perfectory attempts to catalog and address the damages caused by saloons, people during the uprising, supplies stolen, equipment broken, things of that nature. But I was hoping that militia could step in and draw up official report. It's imperative we know what we are working with if we are going to survive. Director Tan, I need my people focused on defending the station, not taking inventory. If you really need militia oversight, I'll get Sergeant Nels to look at it. They said it was my mm, that said it was my understanding that exiles were more Calix's people than Salones. Isn't he the one who started the mutiny? Oh dear lord. Uh Calix may have started it, but Sloan made her allegiances clear. I know she held you in high regard, but I hope you can be in Impartial when it comes to this task. Oh dear lord. Sloan's Kelly Sloan Kelly's not who I thought she was. There won't be a problem. Good, then you won't object to sending a small and dis 
discreet reconnaissance team to find out where Sloan and the Exiles might have gone. When we go, when we do get colonial efforts up and running, I don't need what I don't want any surprises. Um, recon team three twenty-two. Trails cold. Found what looks like abandoned camps in the whatever system, but none with living inhabitants. Only graveyards. The conspirator. Irida, Irida was among the dead, but not Sloan, Sloan Kelly. Okay. Good to know. Container! I'll take that, thank you. Arms Merchant. I can't go down, okay. Been over there. This is next no, is oh, control. Addison, hi. All right, what happened? To who? To whom? And your goddamn father. Sorry, my face is tired from dealing with everything. And right now, I um, just want to know what happened with Alec. I really want to fucking hit you. More specifically, I want to break your nose. Because you're being an ass. And a bitch. And need to fucking stop. I'm all you got. Get the fuck over it. Put on your big girl pants. Stop complaining. And fucking work with me. How about that? All that matters is he's gone. I don't want to get into it. Things went wrong, and now I'm the one you have to deal with. Alec Ryder wouldn't accept that kind of ultimatum. Damned if I will. We'd never have left home if we... <sighs> Not home. The Milky Way. This is home. This mess. We don't have a lot of options, Ryder. Maybe you'll prove your father right. After 14 months of failed colonization, forgive me if I don't hold my breath. What's your relationship with my father, since you're so you goddamn my interested? Alec. No one does that. A lot of us joined the initiative because of his vision. What he shared of it, anyway. Were you friends, or...? I'm not your new mother, if that's what you're asking. Or his friend. Good to know. Glad I can that still I hit you. His title. But no one's a pathfinder until they've path found something. Much like a colonial director without colonies. Well, good for you, honey. Glad to know that you seem to have such knowledge of my father. So nice. Plan for the hostiles. There must be some kind of plan for encountering hostile aliens. We can't have been that naive. We expected life, not an enemy that refuses to talk. They don't attack. They disinfect. We're nothing until we're bacteria. Sorry, 14 months and you stoop to poetry. That's how bad it is. Not sure who started it, but we're calling them Ket. Kandros will know more. Maybe too much. You don't trust him? I trust him to defend us. I do not trust a rising military influence in a supposedly civilian initiative. We came here to make history, Ryder. Not repeat it. Ugh, oh, goddamn poetry. I think all of you are being stupid, except for the Krogan. You guys need to work together if this is ever going to fucking work. And the fact that one of you is being political, another one's being an idiot, and another one's using military power for whatever gain or not gain or whatever. I don't fucking care. What I care about is results and the fact that you fuckers need to want to fucking infight. Oh my god. Exactly. That's my point. Exactly. We're all gonna die, but instead of focusing on how to fix the problem, I'm gonna be a bitch, cause I'm a fucking idiot. How about that, y'all? I'm in charge and I'm a moron. Good to know. Colonial director position. How do you fit into the Nexus leadership? I oversee the actual settlement effort. As the number of outposts is currently less than ideal, my influence is limited. As Tan is quick to remind me. 
left a perfectly adequate career as a chief officer. Provincial capital, too. Only a new galaxy could pull me away. And here we are, idling. Well, maybe take your thumb out of your ass and you wouldn't be idling anymore, honey. Insight into strange tech. There's also this strange, strange tech. Storage technology. Tech. Has oh, anyone it was strange that? Okay. We've tried. Not me. The brains in research. They're supposed to know their business. The current excuse? The tech we dug up on Mars was more advanced, but it was plug and go. The tech here thinks different? I don't know. We've mostly avoided it. Excuse me. And from what the Hyperion logs say about Alec, maybe that's good. Failing outposts. You've had no colony successes in over a year? How many tries is that? Less than you'd think. The Scourge, Spoiled Worlds, Exiles, Hostiles. We can't just plop down an outpost and expect picket fences. We need the Pathfinder and Sam to scout, evaluate, and inspire. The Initiative promised a goal. Andromeda has not cooperated. And if it had? Beautiful, utopian horseshit. Colonies that produce and support each other. The Nexus as Citadel. Not headed by Tan. Or even me. I'm just gonna point out a fact here. You're thinking in fantasy, honey. You know, you read the brochure, you looked at it. You really got it in, stuck in your head. And you were like, fuck yeah, I want to go to a new world. Then you get here. Then there's the reality. And the reality fucking sucks. It's just a bunch of bullshit that you have to deal with before you get to the, the nicer things. You know, like how the real world works. Shit happens. Things don't go as planned. Sometimes shit happens more than you'd like. Sometimes shit happens so fucking bad, your life depends on what happens next. You don't stand here fucking whining about it. You do something about it. Or you can go curl up in a corner and be a whiny bitch where I don't have to talk to you anymore. Just go curl up in the corner and leave me the fuck alone and stay out of my way. How about that? But I bet you're gonna get in my way. All I want to do is fucking hit you. Excuse you're an me, Director idiot. Addison. Ryder? It's Pathfinder. Ryder, we're starving here. If we don't get a foundation of outposts to feed the initiative, we might as well be 600 years dead. Alec promised a lot. None of it panned out. I'm sorry, That's honey. I'm not my father. Why people won't trust you. Why I don't trust you. Oh, I don't need Prove to trust, wrong. honey. I just need to do my fucking job. How about you do yours? Seems like you haven't delivered yet either. Exactly. Exactly. Setting up a literal galaxy that we've ne never been to before. It's going to be a slog for the first few generations. Stop whining about it. I don't want to fucking hear it. I understand it sucks. Too fucking bad. You made the choice to come here. Put on your big girl pants. Lace up them boots. And fucking move on. Do your job. Good God. Do I have to tell everybody that? The only person I haven't had to tell that is the fucking Grogan. Which doesn't surprise me at all. This is the planet where we landed. Habitat 7. It wasn't even close to livable. That's been true of every world we found. Ryder, we were discussing your next expedition. that time I don't have, I, I don't fucking care about time good I was starting to wonder who was in charge around here director Addison is entitled to her opinion and mine overrules ours does she know you that? see that does not I sound like a good thing initiative, and I have decided to give you a chance to prove yourself to that end the score is dealt as a serious blow whatever it is our scientists theorize it's not natural. An artificial no energy shit. cloud? It wasn't here when we left the Milky Way. Yet it rendered all the golden worlds unlivable. Then there's the aliens you ran into. The Ket. They're obsessed with alien structures we found scattered around the cluster. They'll do anything to prevent others from accessing them. It seems murder isn't exclusive to the Milky Way. And now the challenge is to settle well, a world in spite of all that. Well, isn't that just surprising? This one here. Eos. How? You need to increase the viability of the planet so we can establish an outpost. Then we can bring more colonists out of stasis. 
The more colonists we have, the more resources we can gather to support the Nexus. Everything depends on it. There are six worlds we hope to settle. Okay, but you said every planet you found is unlivable, so how do I... A good Pathfinder would relish the challenge of solving it. Right. I think I should go check on things. And if I fail, I guess it's no sweat off your back, right? You'll just look for another Pathfinder? Placing bets on people is part of my job. Some of them pay off. Others... Okay, I'm gonna point something out here. You didn't choose to give me a chance. You have to give me a chance. I'm your only motherfucking option. So let's just pit cut the fucking bullshit here. And stop with the politics. I don't give a fuck what you do, or how you do it. Give me the job, I'll fix your problem. We can move on with our lives, and maybe I'll never have to see you again. How about that? Don't play games with me, honey. The way I see it, you need me. If I pull this off, maybe you'll look like the leader you pretend to be. Exactly. But first, you have to succeed at being the Pathfinder you pretend to be. Where's my ship? I'm the sorry, who's got the balls of steel here? The coordinates for EOS will be in the computer. And when you have a moment, we should discuss the missing arcs. I was wondering about that. <sighs> Something wrong? Ryder, can you see me and Sam on the Hyperion? Your implant needs attention, and we need to discuss a confidential matter. No. I'm fine. Why would I fucking tell you a damn thing anyway? Ryder, you may have a less than flattering view of me, but I want to express my condolences for your father. I bet I you're just it. real broken up about that, know aren't you? Well, although I understand he played a key role in planning the initiative. I'm sure he'd be concerned that we still have several arcs missing. Hmm. What happened to him? Any idea where they went? Nothing certain. But tens of thousands of colonists are unaccounted for. It paints the initiative in an unflattering light. Did you have some other business? Missing arcs. Any more information you can give me on the missing arcs? No. And that is the distressing part. The Asari, Turian, and Salarian arcs are completely unaccounted for. If they had the same problems with the Scourge that we did, I fear the worst. Should you find any clues, please investigate. Without the other arcs, the promise of the initiative can never be fulfilled. Additional arcs? Are there any other arcs we should expect? We had hoped Quarians would be part of the first wave. But before departure in 2185, we got word they had technical problems with their ship. It seems they're also bringing along Drell, Hanar, and other species as well. Managing all of their biological needs caused complications. We won't see them for some time to come. Mm, good to know. Planet viability. What do I need to consider in making a planet viable? Assuming the planet supports life, an outpost is critical. People like a roof over their heads and you'll want to eliminate any hostile threats. Whether that's the cat or other terrors lurking in Helios, colonists being murdered on sight can be discouraging. Also, no scouting shit. and mapping terrain is a priority for any Pathfinder. And don't forget forward stations. You'll want those. What are those? What can you tell me about forward stations? I was afraid you'd ask. It's mostly what the engineers tell me. A forward station allows mining, equipment repairs, and resupply for field teams. I mean, who wouldn't want that? But seeing as how every colonization effort has failed, it's just theory at the moment. You get to test it out, Ryder. Oh, goody. So I'm your fucking guinea pig. Good to know. Uh, Nexus troubles. Sounds like the Nexus has had a rough time of it. Publicly, I would say we're more than up for the challenge. Privately... I can tell you, it's been a disaster. The Scourge killed hundreds, many of them our senior leadership. Even the founder of the initiative, G.N. Garson, is dead. Mysteries on Habitat 7. We came across alien technology on Habitat 7. It seemed to affect the weather. Your people know anything about that? There have been reports. Failed scouting missions have mentioned advanced structures of unknown design. Whatever they are, they defy explanation. But with our resources stretched so tight, no one has had a chance to study them. And what if the answer was bad for morale? 
Suppose these things turn people into food. All we know is the cat are interested in them. I'd rather not stir things up. Andromeda Initiative. What more can you tell me about the initiative? It represents the greatest migration ever attempted. No one had ventured beyond the Milky Way before. We've all left home in search of freedom, fortune, perhaps a new beginning. We are the bravest souls each species has to offer. I hope the Nexus will serve as the seat of government for us all. Uh, motivation for coming. Why do you think most people came? There are thousands of reasons. One for every colonist here. What does any pilgrim seek? Usually, happiness. Finding the thing that eludes them. The thing to fulfill them. While we cannot promise they will find it, we can facilitate the search. Okay, other questions. I don't give a fuck about that. Chance roll. As director of the initiative, are you in charge around here or what? If the others would allow me, they don't see me as the rightful successor. Why the doubt? What's their problem with you? I am not Gian Garson. Our founder was charismatic, eccentric, larger than life. Traits I cannot hope to mimic. She and her inner circle perished in the scourge, some at the hands of the exiles, some never made it out of stasis. I was deputy assistant for revenue management, then all seven leaders above me died. I was next in line for the role. Revenue, man revenue management? What? So, you're an accountant? Don't let that fool you. We are all capable of more than we know. When I was young, I was fascinated by the idea of exploring space. Life had its detours and I went a different direction. Then I heard about the initiative and saw my chance to try the path not taken. While I may not be setting foot on new worlds, my authority can ensure that you do. Right. Sorry. I'm gonna point something out here. I don't give a shit about your authority. I'm the only pathfinder you fucking have. You have no choice here, man. None. And if I'm being honest, it kind of seems like you have everybody else in an iron grip with politics that have nothing to do with this situation. And I think all of you are idiots, except for the Krogan. The fucking Krogan. Come on. Exactly. He's in the same boat as us, and he's derailing us. Y'all are stupid. Good luck. So how does anything get done? In theory, Kesh handles the Nexus's physical operations, Kandros runs the militia, and Addison manages colonial affairs. I oversee all of it. In practice, we argue, debate, and yell at each other until a decision is made. If we're lucky. It is maddening. Oh, I bet it is, but I, ho I honestly don't think it helps pointing fingers and saying all these different things you're gonna have to trust each other you're in a fucking tin can in fucking space in the middle of goddamn nowhere you don't know anything and you don't have a habitable fucking planet to live on you need some trust okay i'm sorry it sucks and you might want to sleep with a fucking gun under your pillow or whatever i don't care do whatever but you're gonna have to trust each other you're gonna have to be a little bit nice to nicer to each other and you're both you're all gonna have to figure out what the fuck to do and you're gonna have to work together somehow or this is never gonna work and we're all gonna die so gee thank you goodbye That's all. thanks for your time of course as you pointed out we need each other our futures depend on each other's success uh yeah sure i'm mad at all of them and i'm finding everyone should be stupid I'm going to end this stream here, guys. I hope you enjoyed the stream. I had a lot of fun. If you want to see previous streams that I've done, go check out me, 